you are the queen of your TF heart or the king of your TF heart because this card shows value and this card talks about your value, your place. So your TF does hold a very strong place in their heart about you your tf this is what your tf thinks about you that you know you are of this you're this king or you're this queen and you're of high value and this is what your tf truly believes about you your tf really does see who you are and they really want to treat you like a queen and take care of you and come back to you and love you and give you all the abundance and love abundance does not mean only money so because it's coin and abundance that is being shown here abundance also means lots of showering of love and date nights and beautiful things your tf really wants to like shower you with love here so they do really 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 care about you this is someone only if you care do you want to take care of someone right your tf really wants to take care of you and keep you like a king or a queen this is value card so do dive into self-care this card also has a message that dive into self-care not external self-care internal self-care so when you do self-care how do you feel about it are you able to receive it do you understand your value your tf definitely understands your value at their core and they really just want to shower you with love and treat you like this treat you like royalty and give you the place like my wife my queen my king my husband this is the place they want to give you they really want to claim you so it's a very powerful powerful card beautiful powerful message so today's card deck is the energy oracle card deck by sandra and taylor so this is the card deck and very beautiful cards your tf is giving a lot of messages stay till the end because there is a lot being revealed by your tf here that they really want you back and this time forever it's being revealed because i already pre-shuffled the cards so the next card i received is the temple path so let's see the path is you <laughs> yeah oh my god this is glorious okay yeah they want a marriage as i can see i sort of see like they want to marry you they want to be with you they want to spend the life with you because i see this as an altar mostly this is what i'm seeing it's an altar and it's the altar they want to end up in with you like hold the hands take the vows take the marriage vows so I'm seeing an altar and the path is you, your TF's path is you. This is what is coming up for me. So they are looking forward to take this path. That's beautiful. Very gorgeous message again. So let's see what is the next one. It is Angel of Balance. So can you see that? The angel of balance. So this is a message for you directly that, well, if you bring balance in your life, it'll be easier for your TF to come back to you. So the angel of balance is telling you, call in support also from your angels, from your spirit guides, from your guru, from your teachers from your coaches you know if through everyone god only flows through so it is not that you know that person is giving their energy it is always god giving that energy so allowing this love and bringing balance into your life so balance means looks like you have been doing a lot of spiritual work and that's why your tf wants to be back with you so congratulations on that and let's see like how the angels is telling you that bring in balance so it looks like you need a lot of grounding what you are going to build is like this foundation right you need a very strong foundation for harmonious union with your twin flame so for your twin flame to join you you need to be very grounded and disciplined so stick on to your spiritual practices 
stay with it stay grounded maybe have a schedule have a routine bring balance into your life ba- bring balance everywhere do the inner work and do the external work balance in life purpose so all this can be learned through ascension school and life purpose classes so you can check it at out at twinflamesuniverse.com so the ascension school and life purpose classes will tell you how to go about this and how to bring balance it's a very very good way to find out how to bring balance in your life and also coaching will help you bring balance because the coach will always guide you back to your alignment your center so going back to your center you just staying in alignment will be healthy and also bringing this in the physicality like having a schedule morning maybe having a routine meditate breathe listen to whatever that grounds you or just doing the mirror exercise in the morning and grounding yourself and bringing balance to yourself and taking care of yourself will help your tf come back to you because your tf is clearly saying that you know you are it for them so this card is interesting the next one i have received deceit so yes don't get worried seeing this card let go of all the deceit so this card reading sort of helps you heal the blocks towards your tf wants to be back with you so these extra cards that come in helps you heal that block that you know whatever you are blocking in your tf right like your tf really wants to be back with you so these instructions will help you heal that and make way for your tf that's why i said stay tuned till the end so that your tf can come back to you so the deceit part is that what where are you holding delusions where are you hiding where are you not being truthful to yourself let's say that you have tightness in you and you're telling i feel good i feel very happy so then that is some sort of deceit you are deceiving your feelings you are hiding your feelings so if you are hiding your feelings your tf will also hide their feelings so just removing this deceit this mask that you are holding on to so that your tf can come back to you your tf really just wants you back so let go of any delusion that you are holding any hiding energy if you are having a mask let go of that and choose to call in your tf because they are ready they want you back forever this time they don't want to play any you know make break games with you they just they just want to be back in love with you back in god with you because you did a lot of inner work and you should be proud of yourself for that so any last bit of deceit you can let it go all the illusions and because it's a lot of work has been done on separation consciousness that's what i can feel right now so anyway just check like you know how you really feel and be really truthful to yourself like am i feeling comfortable am i feeling easy is there control in me is there resistance in me if there is resistance in you choose to see it there's nothing wrong in seeing it so that your tf can come close to you and let's see yes there you go this card is also very nice i love this card so the thinking man look at that the man who is looking at the crystal very masculine energy here looks like this is also a message from the masculines to the feminines and also the masculines who are going through the journey they also have a message in this card so the thinking man means that they this is a man who is sort of healed who feels ready to gaze into the new as you can see it's a very confident man a healed man so it's wonderful like because all the spiritual work probably that you have done all the inner work all the mirror exercise leads to a divine man and a divine person a divine twin flame that will join you when you do all the mirror exercise when your twin flame joins you in union it will be a healed version of them so that's what i'm seeing so they are 
healed quite a lot and that's why they are confident to get back to you you have to make the way to make the way just listen carefully to this card card reading from your heart listen carefully to this card reading from your heart and you will know how to navigate this path how to how to sort of remove the blocks and allow your twin flame to come and claim you they are ready to claim you so do enjoy that right do not block it stay tuned till the end so that your twin flame can come and claim you so this thinking man is looking into this crystal so they are looking forward to seeing you your twin flame is definitely looking forward to seeing you because you and your twin flame seem to be very healed at many levels so it's safe to come into union it is safe to be together you will not run away from each other anymore because you know how to handle yourself you are more spiritually grown spiritually responsible your twin flame is definitely more spiritually grown so that is why they are ready to just come back to you and claim you so you need to let go of your blocks here that is what we are revealing here also this is part of the healing also that this card reading will help you that your twin flame can come back to you and the card reading will make path for that so door to value wow look at this this is such an abundant card so this is some more cards for you towards the end let's see what god directly channels right now right here look at that there's so much abundance there is wealth direct wealth is being shown here so it's like a floodgate of wealth and love that is going to come your way so allow yourself to embrace yourself allow yourself to re receive it i still feel resistance so do choose to let go of the resistance to okay this love this gushing dam of love is not going to hurt you your tf ed is just wanting to gush you with love shower you with gold shower you with everything good basically not technically gold but you know whatever they want to shower you with in love so So it's safe to receive that now. It's time to relax and receive, receive from your TF through God. God is the key. God is the one who is loving you through your TF. Your TF is never your source. Your TF is a healed person because you chose to walk with God, and that's why your TF wants to shower you with all this and come back to you and you know wanting to live this abundant life with you. Your TF really wants to live this. This beautiful abundant life with you it's just this this card reading is just so full of love so full of abundance so full of like tf coming and literally running and like you know grabbing you and like i claim you your mind that's the energy of this card reading this is absolutely gorgeous so this is the final card and i feel this is the final card yeah i don't even need to shuffle Fifth chakra, Archangel Gabriel. <laughs> okay, fifth chakra, Archangel Gabriel. As you can see, Archangel Gabriel is also like a verbal, like a lot of verbal communication is what is coming up. So fifth chakra, the throat chakra, Archangel Gabriel. they want to express to you my god this is so much fun your twin flame wants to express their love to you do you choose to hear it do you choose to hear your expression of love so if you do that this will be very easy for your twin flame they'll come and tell you i love you and i you know you're my sky or <laughs> however they want to express to you so choose to hear your expression first and go express to god how much you love god let god express it back to you that will help you allow your tf to express to you that they love you they really want to say it out actually they don't want to hold it back anymore they want to like really just come and announce it to you that I want to be back with you and your mind and I want to claim you. It's not like some soul level claiming. They really want to verbally communicate this with you because that's why Archangel 
Gabriel and this is chakra I like the throat this is very interesting so any throat healing go ahead and do it any blocks in your throat any blocks towards expressing yourself go ahead and heal that so that this also can be moved like that any mirror exercise just two days three days it takes you know so go ahead and finish off any blocks here heal it and allow your twin flame to say i love you so this is what is coming up for today's reading i hope everybody enjoyed and had a beautiful heart healing during this reading thank you so much god bless